Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm back today with the tutorial for the look on my face right now. This is my travel makeup look. I know some people normally would never wear makeup when they travel, but since I'm going to be vlogging this entire trip, I want to at least look a little presentable. So I decided to just go ahead and put on a very, very natural looking makeup look. As natural as you can get with purple and blue and pink hair and makeup on your face. I mean, I don't know. This is going to be a very quick video just because I'm not using a lot of products. I'm literally only using foundation, a pressed powder, mascara, a little bit of eyeliner, and that's about it. But I figured this would be perfect for those of you who like to wear at least a little bit of makeup when you do go out and travel. As you guys know, I'm going to be in Florida for the next few days. I leave actually tomorrow night to go to the airport, but my flight isn't until like 2.30 in the morning on Wednesday. And I get to Fort Lauderdale at 5 in the morning, which I think is perfect because my dad and I have this little thing now where he'll pick me up from Fort Lauderdale, we'll drive to Boca and go eat breakfast at my favorite breakfast spot in Boca Raton in Palm Beach County. This restaurant called Poppy's, it's like the best place in the world. I love it so much. I've been going there since I was a little muñequita little girl and I honestly love the food, it's so, so good. So I'm so excited to go there and have a bagel. So with that being said, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you do, give it a thumbs up and hope you guys enjoy. Hey guys, welcome back. So, the first thing I'm going to do is obviously hydrate and moisturize my skin. So I'm going to go to my H2O Plus Beauty Oasis Hydrating Treatment. This, for the past month, has been my go-to moisturizer because, number one, it smells amazing. But it also does an amazing job of making my skin feel very, very moisturized without leaving any weird residue because the ones I used to use in the past would leave a weird foam on my skin without really settling into it so I'd feel like I looked greasy all the time. This doesn't do that, so that is the reason why this is my favorite right now. Not to mention it's a shade of blue, which you guys know is my all-time favorite color. I'm gonna go ahead and just scrape it with my nail and just apply it to a couple different places. Now I'm going to take my beauty blender that has glitter all over it and we're going to apply some foundation to my face. I'm only using a very little amount but I also want to do my neck as well because no one wants to have orange rings around their neck girl. That ain't cute girl. Girl, the shade, the shade of it all. <laughs> so if I'm being honest, I wouldn't normally wear foundation for travel days just because I'm traveling but I'm going to be vlogging the entire time so I at least want to look a little bit awake when I do so. No, normally I use two foundations, one a little bit darker and this one. As you can see, you can now see why I use two, because this one looks light as fuck. But then again, it actually is matching pretty well, so maybe I'm just this white. <sighs> so now we're going to set our foundation with this Wet n Wild pressed powder. I'm also doing this because it's going to bring some color back to my face that looks ghostly white right now. So now I'm going to take my Butter Bronzer from Physicians Formula and just do a very slight contour, nothing too dramatic. Honestly, I just want to bring some color back into my face because that little pressed powder did nothing to do so. I'm going to take my Hikari Eyeliner, this is in the shade Raven, and I'm going to tight line my upper lash line. And then I'm going to apply my Tarte Tartist Mascara. You guys know this is a holy grail. Did my brows quickly off camera, just ran some black matte eyeshadow in them. I'm still trying to figure out how to do my brows as far as color since my hair is now like multicolored. So I figured I'd just do black since that kind of just goes with everything. And then I'm going to take this really pretty like pinky light shade and we're going to pop that right into the inner corner. For some highlighter, I'm going to take this pink highlighter right here that I put in the inner corner of my eye on my Highlight and Glow brush by Royal and Lingnical. I'm going to just pop that right there. And then for the lips, I'm going to apply my go-to nightly lip balm. This is from CoverGirl. This is the OXXO lip balm. This is an SPF 15 in it. This stuff is amazing. Normally, drugstore lip balms outside of like Blistex and things like that, they don't usually work for me, but the three lip balms they release that look like this are absolutely amazing. I wear these every single night before bed and I wake up and my lips feel so moisturized and hydrated. They look healthy, they feel healthy. So yeah, if you can still find these in the drugstore, I highly suggest picking them up. They're absolutely amazing. I have all three of them. I found mine at my local CVS, if that helps. 
So the same day I'm filming this, I'm also going to upload it so you guys have some content. I didn't upload any content the past two days because I normally take my weekends off and I definitely need my weekend off to get laundry done, to get packed and get ready for the trip. So I decided to just give you guys a quick break from my videos, but you guys are going to see this on the same day that I'm filming it. The next video you guys are going to see is most likely going to be my what's in my travel bag video, my everyday makeup, my holy grail makeup. So I'll have that video for you guys probably the day after on Tuesday. So that'll be the video you guys watch as I'm traveling to Florida. And then I'll have my first vlog video up on the second day of me being in Florida. So with that being said, guys, I'm going to get on out of here and start filming that what's in my travel bag bag. So with that being said guys, I'm all done here for today's video, but I'm going to see you guys in my next video, which is going to be my what's in my travel bag video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you're not already and I'll see you guys next video. I love you guys so much.